Ever pondered about the conditions on other planets? Well, today we're taking a thrilling journey through our solar system, guided by none other than our brave explorer, Timmy the Turtle. He's ready to dive into the mysteries of the cosmos, and he's inviting you to join him on this adventure. Our first stop is Mercury, the smallest planet in our solar system and the closest one to the sun. It's a world of extreme temperatures where the days are scorching hot and the nights are freezing cold. Imagine that. Timmy with his tough shell can handle it, but it's not a place for a vacation. Next up, we have Venus, the second planet from the sun. It's similar in size to our own Earth, but it's much hotter. Venus is known as the evening star because it shines brightly in the sky just after sunset. But don't let its beauty fool you. Its surface is rocky and covered with thick clouds of sulfuric acid. Timmy would need a sturdy umbrella for this one. Now, we journey to our home Earth, the third planet from the sun. It's a unique place in our solar system because it's the only planet known to support life. It's covered in water, has an atmosphere, and houses diverse ecosystems. Timmy, of course, loves Earth because it's where his favorite pond is located. Next in line is the red planet Mars. It's called red because its surface is covered in iron oxide, which gives it a rusty color. There's a lot of interest in Mars because scientists think it might have had conditions suitable for life in the past. Though, Timmy is not too sure about swapping his pond for the Martian desert. Our next stop is the largest planet in our solar system, Jupiter. It's a gas giant, which means it doesn't have a solid surface. One of the most recognizable features of Jupiter is its great red spot, a giant storm that's been raging for hundreds of years. Timmy would have a hard time finding a place to put his feet up here. Next, we visit Saturn, the second largest planet. It's famous for its beautiful rings made of ice and rock. Saturn has more than 60 moons, one of which, Titan, has lakes and rivers of liquid methane and ethane. Timmy finds it fascinating but prefers his pond's fresh water. Then, we journey to Uranus, a planet with a unique feature. It spins on its side. It's a chilly world with temperatures dropping to 200 degrees below zero. Even Timmy, with his thick shell, would find it a bit too cold. Finally, we reach Neptune, the furthest planet from the sun. It's a windy world with the strongest winds in the solar system, reaching speeds of over 1,000 miles per hour. Timmy decides he'd rather not deal with such strong winds, and thus ends our cosmic journey. We visited eight planets, each with its unique features and wonders. From the scorching heat of Mercury to the icy winds of Neptune, Timmy the turtle has led us on a fascinating exploration. Remember, even though the universe is vast, we're all part of this amazing cosmic neighborhood. So next time you look up at the night sky, think about the incredible journey you've just taken. Until next time, keep exploring and stay curious.